Reddit remix. I have a Grinch fetish. My boyfriend knows about this and for the most part accepts this. He isn't crazy about it and doesn't really get it, but he at least tries, which is all I ask. He'll sometimes read the book to me to set the mood <laughs> or, <laughs> or if he's really feeling kinky, tell me you're a mean one in the heat of the moment. <laughs> <laughs> he's even begrudgingly come around to at least playing one of the three versions of the film every time we do the deed, although we tend to stay away from the live action one because it's too much for me. It's too much for me. The live action one. <laughs> the thing is, I don't want to hear about the Grinch or listen to the Grinch, watch the Grinch. I want to be fucked by the Grinch. <laughs> and for the record, this is common among women. It is? It's common? Women want to have sex with the Grinch? Yeah, I don't know. You maybe need to make new friends. <laughs> <laughs> the Grinch's bulging sack of toys to me and many others is what a Mack truck is to Cardi B. I don't know. I don't get any of those things. The fact that he's good with dogs and experience. He's not good. He tortures Max. He is horrible to that dog. What the fuck are you talking about? Okay. The fact that he's good with dogs and experienced trauma at a young age makes me want a long, fuzzy dick even more. Oh my god. I hate this. <laughs> <laughs> my boyfriend asked me what I wanted for Christmas, and I told him straight up. I told him to put on the greenest, silkiest Grinch costume he could find, kidnap me from my bed on Christmas Eve, and then ravage me in front of the Christmas tree. Yo. He flat out refused. Said it was too weird for him. I was literally begging this man to let this pussy save Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> and he was like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> and it, it ended up turning into a fight <laughs> where he admitted he only gave in to my initial Grinch kinks to placate me and was still uncomfortable about the fact that I had moaned Grinch during sex. <laughs> <laughs> He's drawn a line, and if I don't drop the Grinch fetish, which, as I said, is incredibly common among women, but sadly taboo, he's done for good. I don't want to lose him over this, but it's really hard for me to see past my sexual proclivities, especially during Christmas season. Is there any way we can even compromise on this, or do I simply need a more adventurous man? Oh, my God. <laughs> Look, I don't want to kink shame. <laughs> Anybody? Mm -mm. No, who does? Probably took a lot to mm -hmm. have the good courage to put this on Reddit. Of all places, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, if you have a need and you want it satiated, uh -huh. then you have to ask for what you want. So yes. she's she's doing what we would recommend in a relationship. Mm -hmm. However, you mm -hmm. also have to be okay with the response. Yes. I was with somebody that really wanted me to dress like a cop. And I just, I don't like costumes. No. Of any you don't. kind. Of any kind. I'm not a dress up guy. I never have been. I don't, no. uh, I like Halloween for the candy. I, I think sometimes seeing people in costumes is cute. Mm -hmm. You know, I can appreciate a good costume like anybody else. Sure. Um, but I don't need to dress up like one. But uh, I think you can't shame your boyfriend for not wanting to put his fuzzy green dick into you. <laughs> true that's a good point i will say to the guy who doesn't want to be the grinch you it i know it's weird but you may be missing out on some of the best sex you'll ever have uh i one time looked like captain jack sparrow and uh the girl i was with was so turned on <laughs> and then that became sort of a regular staple and at one point because i can do impressions was like please learn how to do a captain jack sparrow impression and talk dirty to me and i did do, i did do that i did do that <laughs> and it was amazing <laughs> the grinch is a whole other level though bro because he like 
Like, what if you want to have that on a constant basis? What do you always have to have a Christmas tree ready? <laughs> you got to fucking put the Christmas tree up, strap on the fucking thing. Does he does he get makeup put on? Like, there's a whole other level to this that is. But like uh, Captain Jack Sparrow, or being a cop, like those are kind of easy to understand sexual archetypes. Sure. Right, you're a pirate or you're uh -huh. a fucking cop. You're some kind of an authority, mm -hmm. some kind of a rogue mm -hmm. human being. The Grinch is this disgusting dumpy. <laughs> he is dumpy. <laughs> so dumpy. He's just fat and. Oh God, my favorite thing ever. His shoes are his shoes are too tight. I love <laughs> the fact. That she's like, yo, he ha he went through a hard childhood, and that <laughs> makes me even hornier. Fuck. Yeah, and like, and your and your idea of good with pets. He's horrible to that dog. He mistreats Max, and the most egregious of what he forces him to be complicit in his his scheme to steal Christmas. Yeah, he 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 ties an around. oversized branch to his head. <laughs> carves off some of the pieces until he's right side up sends him down the hill where he snowballs <laughs> yeah he makes him chill with all of the presents he stole and then force and he whips him up mount crumpet he is terrible yeah. to that fucking dog i bet you if yeah. the grinch was hungry enough he'd eat max he doesn't give a fuck about max <laughs> no. but I also love that the live action version is too much. Like it's like she's she's overstimulated. Like the concept <laughs> of Jim Carrey walking in and being like, ah, I'm gonna hate the who's alphabetically. <laughs> she's just like, ah, ah. <laughs> uh, fuck. You know, yeah, I think Greg's right. That's um, yeah, you can't. It, that's what you want and maybe it is if if you can't get over this this big sexual hill you know maybe go look for somebody who does uh i mean overall have a have a think on what your relationship feels like without it is it is does are you fulfilled without the grinch thing um sexually and or emotionally you know do you feel fulfilled if not you know start looking elsewhere uh but uh, you know, and good luck to both of you. I good luck. I hope you get yeah. what you want. Yeah. Happy New Year. 